Hey guys, welcome to ELA with Miss Garrett. Today we're going to be working with grammar. We're actually going to be looking particularly at interjections. I know that we've talked about conjunctions a lot and we've talked about nouns and pronouns and verbs and adverbs and adjectives and all of that stuff. But today we're going to focus on interjections. And interjections are really cool. I really love them because I feel like they add a lot of emotion and drama and suspense to the stories that we read because they do. Interjections show emotion. And if you'll look back here at the anchor chart with me for just a moment, you can see that interjections show emotion. They can be used to show greeting, agreement, or disagreement, and sounds. So I'm just going to review these with you really quickly, and I want you to pay close attention to how I read them, because the way that I read them shows you that it's an interjection. Wow! Bravo! Ouch! Oh no! Hooray! So you can see by the way I read those as a reader, I'm showing emotion. I'm showing the character's emotion. Whatever character, you know, chose to say this, whatever the author um, wanted to convey when they decided to include that interjection into their writing. Now, greeting. Hello. Hi. Hey. you who um, or, bye, see you later, bye, okay, um, agreement, sure, nope, okay, yeah, no, do you see how I read those differently, and then down here we've got our sounds, <gasps> yikes, ah, whew, you see how that conveys emotion, whew, I'm probably a little relieved there, eek, I might use that if I saw a spider. Heek, said Miss Garrett as a spider scampered across the floor. Yuck. Aww. And then on the sides we've got boom, pow. So think about it as those words, those really exciting words. And they can be used, like I said, to convey emotions such as happiness, excitement, but also feelings of sadness or anger even, okay? But when you're reading, I want you to pay close attention. Um, those interjections are usually just that one quick word and they can show emotion, greeting, agreement, sounds. A lot of times we think of them as those sound words, you know, yikes, ah! those words that have that sound associated with them. So when you're reading today, you've got a selection that you're going to read and you're going to pay close attention to those interjections. Now the paragraphs are labeled for you to make it easier for you to find the paragraphs because some of the paragraphs are actually only about one or two sentences and that's okay. That's just the way that the author chose to write that piece, okay? So if you have any questions at all, make sure that you raise your hand on class kick, jot us a little note, and your teacher will get right back with you. Again, we missed you over spring break. We are so excited to see you today. Bye. Hey, that was an interjection. Bye.